Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anil and in this Laravel video tutorial, we will learn that how we can create a search API. And this search API will perform a two kind of action, one with the complete match and another one is the character match, right? So if uh, let's say we have a this string and we just want to search with the A character, then this result will be shown because A is matched here, right? So these are the points of the video. First of all, we will see why we use the get method with the search API. Then we will set up our, our postman for API. Then we will make a route and a search function. And after that, we will test API. And at the last, I will ask you a question. I'm going to attempt this question in the comment box also. Now, uh, my first question is why we use the get method for the search API? Why we cannot use uh, post, put, and delete? The reason is simple because get method is basically used for fetch the data, right? So if you just want to operation, make some other operation like create, update or delete, then we can use the another methods. For just simply fetching the data, we always use the get method. It can be a search match or it can be a where condition level match or it can be a jump, uh, pagination uh, result, right? So in that all cases, whenever we are just fetching the data, we will use the get method. Now let's uh, set up the postman for API. So. As we know, we have to just select the get method from here. Then uh, we can just put our URL and this is the base URL till our API. Then um, we can use a search keyword and then we will uh, make any string. Let's say I just want to search for a mobile or something. There, there will be a string simply, right? Like this, any string. So for that, we need to make a route also. So again, let's uh, just jump on the routes and api.php, right? And let's make a route here. Route colon colon get method. And uh, we, here we put the search keyword. That's why we will just use get here a search keyword. And the second parameter, we will uh, use a device controller, which is our controller name. And in the second parameter of uh, this array, we will use a function that we use for API, right? And let's use a semicolon. And now let's go for this controller, HTTP controllers and here, and let's uh, simply define a search method because we just uh, tell to the router that we will use a search method here, right? and uh, obviously we are we will just send the data or string from here then that's why we need to just use the router param also so just simply put here slash with the name inside the curly braces and just simply put here dollar name as like this right and now as you know in the old videos we also using the device module and which is also imported on the top Right, which is also used in the all delete and uh, update and all APIs. So just uh, simply uh, return. Uh, you can just use a device colon colon where, and we will put our condition like uh, name, and name will be come inside a dollar name parameter, and at the last we will use the get method like this so just uh, simply put here in the string now let's say laptop and let's try to search now you can see that we get the result with the ID name and number right so let's look check out is it present yes on a two we have a laptop with ID two. so this is working fine so now let's say you just want to make a search for computer and this is working fine so now let's say I just want to search for M but uh, there is no data. Why? Because there is a no direct entry with the name of M. There is a mobile computer. So let's say we just want to make a search on a character base. Then we can use uh, here the like query, right? So just use here like and uh, use here M percent dot dot and then again M percent, right? It will just find that if he just uh, API just find any character uh, in a complete string, then it will just return it. So now let's try it again. 
and now you will find the four result here here you can see that because in mobile is present inside the m uh, m is present in the mobile again in the computer again in the mac and mac so let's say just want to search here mac now so now we have the two result and if we are just search for p then we have again two result because p is present in the laptop and computer so this is about a simple uh, get api so now my question is so let's say in some case i'm just going to search a long string and i find no result right there is no data in the instead of uh, just this blank array we should have to show that there is a no result found in this api that how we can show this so you can attempt this uh, question in a comment box if you want and thanks for watching this video please don't forget to subscribe my channel if you have any concern query you can ask me in the comment box also bye bye take care